Hello everyone. Good morning and good afternoon, depending on where you are. My name is Abu Aslam. I'm the Senior Manager Partnerships at Water.org in Bangladesh. Welcome. Today, our webinar topic is Sub Supply Hotspot, the case of Bangladesh. I'll talk a little bit how the small loans making a big impact for self supply. Here, I'll share our work and experiences on the self supply in Bangladesh. In particular, I will share impacts through our flagship program model called Water Credit Program. As you already know, self supply is the mechanism of people upgrading their water services largely by themselves. As you all know, Bangladesh is a birthplace of microfinance. There are about 760 MFIs having around 33 million members and more than 26 million borrowers. So some of the key players are working here in Bangladesh for a market-based solution for self-supply mainly by water.org and other key stakeholders. T-boils have been privately installing by the households in Bangladesh. Therefore, household financed MDG advances towards improved rural drinking water accesses. However, achieving SDG 6.1 implies transition from provision of access to risk management models. As we all know, the water crisis is an economic crisis. About 260 million US dollar is lost globally each year due to lack of basic water and sanitation. In spite of that, the women and girls spend 200 million hours a day to collect only the water. In this situation, we water the door in between the day when everyone has access to safe water and dignity of a toilet. In a very short who we are, so we are water to dog is breaking down the barriers down uh, uh, barriers between people and access to safe water and sanitation. We are an international non-profit organization that has positively transformed transformed 46 million lives around the world. Founded by Gary White and Matt Damon, Water.org pioneers market driving financial solutions to the global water crisis. For more than 30 years, we have been providing women hope, children health, and families a future. Currently, we have 155 active partners in 11 countries. Now, um, as I already talked, uh, we are working for our flagship program called Water Credit Program. Uh, um, so one of the major barriers to safe water and sanitation is affordable financing. Uh, uh, Water Org created the Water Credit Initiative Loan Program to address this barrier head on. Water credit helps bring small loans to those who need access to affordable financing and expert resources to make household water and toilet solutions a reality. By making small loans to individuals who need them, water credit empowers to address their own water and sanitation needs. The repaid loans go back into the revolving fund and are then reloaned to the next individual or community. Water credit is demand driven, harshening the power of people from the bottom up. Now I'll talk a little bit on the process of the program. So water.org raised more than, sorry, in the diagram, if we see water.org uh, raised household through financial institutions, as well as wash NGOs. Banks and capital providers are also linked 
through the financial institutions. There are other key players in the system, such as uh, uh, small, uh, uh, medium, uh, enterprises, water and sanitation suppliers, machines, and so on. If we see the impact, uh, water rock reached more than 46 million people uh, with water and sanitation, where the half of the percentage is water. More than 10 million uh, household covered, 3.7 billion capital disbursed uh, in loans, and average repayment rate is 99%. Now, we'll see a little bit um, in aspects of Bangladesh. Uh, so in Bangladesh, we have been partnering, uh, that we have been supporting the scaling of water supply financing in particular through our flagship integrated approach water credit program since 2015. Till now, we have partnered with 21 leading microfinance institutions. We bought resources and consulting expertise to our partners equipping them to successfully add water and sanitation loans to their portfolios of offerings. So through this water credit, they are making water and sanitation loans accessible to those who need them the most, and the results are astounding. Till now, in Bangladesh, um, we are able to positively uh, uh, raise the lives of uh, uh, 6 million people, 1.2 million households served through the uh, water credit loans, 412 million US dollar mobilized at, as, as capital. Uh, if we see the average loan size is 333% US dollar, 98% of our borrowers are women, uh, and you know uh, about 90% uh, borrowers uh, lives in the live in the rural areas. Uh, so average month to repay the loan is 17. And as I told already, most of the most of our people are living in the um, uh, bottom of the pyramid. Uh, uh, so 81% is. Uh, household living under the uh, $6 um, per day. So now um, the cover is uh, we almost um, are working in every corner of the country. Already we have raised 61 districts in Bangladesh among 64. So there are uh, many more opportunities in this market. Um, the market remains highly untapped now, so improves overall uh, performance of the loan portfolio. Uh, so there is opportunity for uh, water supply and sanitation products, innovations, and to introduce technology in lending, collecting, monitoring, and reporting processes. Also, uh, to, to create social capital and leverage with the central and local government bodies and partners. Uh, so far till now, we are working with the financial institutions now, and also we are working with the PR organizations, water technology companies, different government uh, departments. Our hope is to wide, um, to more uh, widely, um, um, to, to work more widely and to cover more people um, so that you know everyone will have the access of safe drinking water through the self-supply model. I am stopping here. If there is any questions, I'll love to address this question. Um, so till then, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.